students can sign in and out, head to the sick bay if they're unwell or have hurt themselves, or go to the conference room for SIRC meetings slash teacher meetings. This is the library. This is where students can either study or hang out during recess and lunch. While you're in the library, you can either read a book, play some board games, or use the computers in the library. When you're in the library, you can also look at the amazing posters that are hung up on the wall or hanging from the ceiling. Welcome to Seaweed. This is where middle school students have a majority of their classes. And it's conveniently placed right next to the library. Sea Wing has been rebuilt recently with eight new classrooms and a small seating space. And this is one of the eight brand new classrooms with the new tables and chairs and even with a wall mounted TV. Welcome to the school canteen. Students can get wonderful food at the canteen during recess and lunch. When you're at the canteen, you will see our wonderful and hard-working canteen staff trying their hardest to get the best food for you. This is Hatred. This is where our year sevens and eights have their classes. In this wing, there's 13 classrooms, with two of them being kitchens, and one of them is even a cafe. And this is the Valadel Cafe, where we have an array of food and beverages that are delicious. In year 9 and 10, you get to work here as an elective. And from my experience, it was really fun. Now, I think I might have a hot chocolate and some truffles. What are you going to have? This is the junior school area. This is where the year 7s and 8s like to hang out during recess and lunch. When you're in the junior school area, you can see some fabulous art on the wall and you can also see our school pizza oven. At Marvel, students can play sports like basketball during recess and lunch. Marvel can also be used as a secondary PE space. Marvel is also right next to the Oval, which is another PE space that students can use. This is the stadium. In the stadium, students will participate in physical education or have school assemblies. In the stadium, we have a massive storeroom with tons of equipment. We also have two change rooms. Next to the stadium, we have the bus stop, where students will enter and exit the school via buses. And this is the town square, where students come to relax, hang out, and head to their classes. Throughout the town square, there is art referencing the creation story, where Bunjil the Eagle landed on the mountain just over there. This school has many native and indigenous plants that are planted throughout the town square. This is Dewey. This is where students have art, viscom, and media. In D-Wing, there are lots of art on the walls for former and present students. This is the dark room. This is where we develop black and white films, use pinhole photography, and create photograms in year seven. This is the sustainability hub. Students from all over the college have their classes in the sustainability hub, but mainly they have their science classes. The cool thing about the Sustainability Hub is that you can open all the doors to have one massive classroom, which is great for school activities. This is E-Wing. E-Wing is the Technology and Performing Arts Wing. Some subjects you can do in E-Wing are Systems, Drama and Music. And this is E6, also known as the Music Room. In E6, Year 7s will learn music or students will participate in extracurricular musical activities. This is the Performing Arts Centre, most commonly referred to as the PAC. This is where we do our performance evenings, which includes our music and our drama students. We also do our year level assemblies, our whole school assemblies, open night, and we also do our end of year awards. This is the conference room, where the SIRC, also known as the Student Interactive Representative Council, have their weekly meetings where they can have their voice in our school community.